Back at it, January 29th, 2021. Got some more troop to serve up today. Looking at this headline with Cicely Tyson. She reported that she passed away at 96. Um, looking at that 96, it brought something to mind that we had talked about earlier this year with the 69 code. The 69 to 96 is a reflection. It's a mirror um, that is also symbolic of the Vesica Pisces. Okay, it's the yin and yang. It's the sun and the moon. Okay, you got two light beings that have eternal life that you see in the sky every day. The sun and the moon and all this Saturn talk reminds me of the moon. Like, that's the moon. The moon does everything they say Saturn does. And it does turn what they say black when there's a new moon. So, you know, we're gonna remove all of this garbage and this nonsense and let's get to let's get to this. The the we see the the, the women masons, the Prince Hall. We see this is a very old photo in the video that I did last year. And then we see it come to the forefront this year with Whoopi Goldberg, now we see why she was chosen to be on that show and she's been on there for a long time. They all together. All these people are together, part of these organizations. So she wore her Prince Hall uh, sweater and she got a lot of flack over that. And, um, you know, this was a recent uh, incident that happened this year and we see the affiliation with the Masons. Uh, this is a well-known thing. And uh, I guess she apologized for wearing it. I don't know what she's apologizing for because she's not sorry. Uh, <laughs> it's funny how these people do this stuff. But I want to get back to uh, Kamala Harris here. Because that 69 is related to her becoming president on June the 9th. Right? We see the, the reference from Trump from a few years ago about Pocahontas. And then I pulled up this image. This is a post that I did in 2019 on her becoming president. Uh, before anyone else ever talked about her becoming president like people like to lie a lot to take clout but that's okay we're not gonna go into that but we can see that she with her husband is just like a, a, a updated version of pocahontas with her husband okay and then she did become the first woman vice president we see this is all synced up we see they just had a uh official i just did a recent video on that where it was a uh, a lady that's going to be refereeing the Super Bowl and she refereed the college big games and they use the same woman. So I see them doing the same thing. Harris just recently, um, she just recently swore in uh, Janet Yellen to be the first U.S. Treasury. So we can see the, the so-called change of the guard from the man to the woman, from the nine to the six. It was inevitable. It started with the women, the matriarch system and the patriarch led to the patriarch system and then it's coming back to the matriarch system and then we look at uh kamala harris birthday october the 20th to today is exactly 102 days so we can see october the 20th the one two the one zero two the two zero one it's all the same code and we can see it being used and there's her birthday we already ran the uh calculation because Looking at one date from another date is a calculation that's being performed. Numerology is mathematics. It's, uh, it's higher frequency to where you can see an alignment that's not being told to you. And then we see uh, Cicely Tyson, her birthday, uh, December the 19th. Go ahead and put her in there. Then it syncs up with Harriet Tugman because Cicely Tyson... She played Harriet Tugman in, in, in a lot of movies, a lot of slave movies. There was all movies. Like the only thing they know about slavery is some damn movies. Roots and which was proven in court to be fake. It's like all this mind control and psyops, they've been running these from the longest. And then we know that's related to that $20 bill with Harriet Tugman. And it goes back to the George Floyd incident last year with Biden. And all this is in the videos. You can look at them on the channel. You can see the uh, the prediction that predicted Biden and Harris and Harris being chosen that's on there that was done in April uh, everything is here we're going to keep adding to this and we're going to keep 
uh, focusing on knowing the truth and, uh, you know, taking the power back that's being taken from us with lying to us and playing mind games with us. We can never come into our rightful power being misled and, and, and play with psychologically with these psyops, okay, psychological operations. So that should tell you what, what's really going on. And then you have the propaganda, which is a legal lie to where the system is allowed to lie to you legally. And it's okay. And we know this is all bullshit.